from Colorado's high definition news leader. This is Nine News. All right, thanks so much, Amelia. At 646 now on your money, we're checking in on the progress of the new exemplar St. Joseph Hospital. The $623 million facility is being built on the former Denver site of the Children's Hospital. It is bringing a lot of jobs and really changing the look and feel of that area. Joining us in the Information Center right now is the hospital CEO, Bain Ferris. Good morning to you, Bain, and thanks for joining us. Good morning. This is a massive project as we take a look at some of the new drawings of what this is going to look like when finished. Walk us through some of the highlights. What, a 348-bed facility? That's right, Greg, 348 beds. Uh, 17 new ORs, are really a completely replacement hospital of the building that uh, has been in, in Denver for 138 years. We actually have a 1910 building, a 1932 building, and two 1964 towers in the current facility. This is scheduled to open up in late 2014. How many jobs, though, are being created during the construction phase? It's a great question. At the peak construction, we'll have 1,500 workers on the site working on the construction. That's in addition to the 2,300 associates that already work at St. Joe's Hospital. I know it's a little hard to crystal ball this, but will you add any new positions to the hospital once it's open? We're hoping to as, as our volume grows and as people downtown understand that the newest hospital in Colorado is going to be in their neighborhood, we think that'll cause people to consider us and we're looking for additional doctors to help care for the people downtown. Construction never a fun thing to have to deal with when you live in that area of where it's going on, but the community has been pretty uh, pretty patient, haven't they? They've been more than patient, Greg. They've been phenomenal. In fact, the, we've had advisory committees. They've been supporting us for over two years. Uh, it has been a mess since last June when we started doing these projects, but I, I can only thank them uh, every sure. day for all they've done. Well, just yesterday you opened up some of the new uh, road configurations, right? Now, Downing is, is open again back on its old grid. The 20th Street connection is open, and, and by next week we'll have the Franklin to Downing opened, and so we'll, we'll have some much better Great. traffic flow. What's going to happen to the current site where you are right now at 18th and Franklin? Do you know? A good deal of the old hospital will be torn down in 2015, uh, but uh, that's part of the plan to make room for additional office space, et cetera, for the future. Bain Ferris, CEO of St. Joseph Hospital. Thanks for coming in. We appreciate the update. Thanks for having me.